start with Paris Lawson, OKCThunder.com. Justin, 32 assists tonight for you guys. And this time it was Al leading the way with nine assists. But every single player who stepped on the floor for you guys recorded an assist. What does it do for your offense when you guys are spraying the ball around so effectively like that? It's huge. I mean, I think the number one thing is it makes it really hard to guard. Um, so obviously we have a ton of great offensive players. Um, but the fact that we make it so hard for the other team to guard us, um, it makes it so much easier for us to score. So, you know, 32, that's amazing an amazing number. So um, for us, I think just trying to continue to play that way, obviously we might not have 32 assists every game, but trying to play that same way every time. And if we can do that, I think um, we could really, really make a run at this thing. Joe Masato, the Oklahoman. Yeah, Justin, can you just take us through your clutch three there at the end and, and getting that pass from, from Bays and what you saw there? Yeah, I mean, I think really the should be a shout out to Bays, the fact that he caught that ball from not going out of bounds. Um, but really, it was just I was just spaced. Lou tried to go in there and make a play. He kicked it out to Bays. And like I said, he made an amazing catch. And for me, I saw the shot clock kind of running down. So I just tried to step into it and knock it down. And, you know, thankfully, uh, good, good Lord blessed me on that one. And then I wanted to ask one follow up. Mark was just saying that I think he said every game day you go to the facility at around nine o'clock. Um, to get some shots up. Has that always sort of been your routine? And did you uh, question doing that this morning with the weather we had? Um, yeah, I mean, I, for me, I just, you know, because we don't necessarily have a shoot around every game, um, I just like to get some sort of shots up in the morning. And so that's kind of what I try to do um, every game day morning. And honestly, I almost wasn't able to. I didn't know necessarily if the gym was, was going to be available or um, whatever with the, with the weather. Um, but thankfully, I was able to get in there and so yeah, that's that's kind of a normal routine for me. Myron Patton, Fox Twenty Five. Yeah, another close game for you guys. You close this one out. Was it just a matter of making some big shots like the one you made, or was there something else that allowed you to win a close one uh, that you weren't able to win uh, early in the week? Um, you know, I think it's just a matter of uh, you know we weren't able to pull out the last three against the Lakers and Denver. Um, you know, and, and I think a part of it is they're a really good team. Um, all of, both, of the, both of those teams are really good. The Bucks were really good. Um, but honestly, the game of basketball is so um, up and down. It really just comes down to a few plays. Um, and so thankfully, we made some plays. Um, we made enough plays to be able to come out with the win tonight. And so I think it's just a matter of building the momentum. Um, you know, like, like Coach, Coach always said, um, even after those three tough losses, um, you know, don't lose the competitive edge. And for us, now with this, you know, it's a pretty big win against, you know, the number two team in the East. So just trying to build on that momentum and hopefully keep on getting better. Logan Newman, Thunderwire. Hey, Justin. Um, first off, were you surprised to be put in the starting lineup today? And then what was communicated to you about what your role was going to be in the game? Um, you know what? I'm just, I'm here, whatever role coach needs me to be in, you know, so if it's starting coming off the bench, um, whatever it is, I'm here for it. And so coach said I was out there tonight and, you know, that's kind of what I went with. Um, and for me, you know, as far as role, I just try to go out there and be aggressive, um, whether that's scoring, whether that's passing the ball, rebounding, whatever it is, I just try to go out there and be, be as aggressive as I can and take advantage of the opportunity that I have on the court. Um, so really that's just kind of my mindset, whatever coach, you know, if he calls my number to start the game, if he calls my number at, you know, seven minutes in the second quarter, first quarter, whatever it is, I'm there, I'm ready for it.